The late NTV video editor Raphael Nzioki has been laid to rest at his family home in Shimba Hills in Kwale County. Raphael was killed in a hit and run accident in Nairobi a week ago. A somber mood engulfed the homestead of NTV's Raphael Nzioki as family, friends and colleagues from Nation Media Group gathered at his home in Kwale County for the final rites. Raphael has been eulogized as a young, energetic, jovial fellow who carried his duties diligently. There is a lot we can say about him, the jovial guy, the ever laughing person who really made a dull moment very nice for all of us. And as you can see, uh, this team was uh, working in different departments, which means Raphael really touched uh, different uh, departments and people in different ways and capacities. To imagine that you are no more Raphael does not make any sense to us. You are a very good person, God-fearing, honest, loving, kind, friendly, hardworking, and a very happy person. The 26-year-old was the firstborn in a family of four. Is left behind a four year old baby girl. The late Raphael met his death in the wee hours of Saturday last week when he was knocked down by a matatu driving on the wrong side as he crossed the road on Kenyatta Avenue and Kimathi Street Junction. Nayoma Sampao, NTV.